Welcome to Spinelli Speaks. Welcome back to my channel, Danny here. I am kind of being silly today. I was thinking for a while, like, I have a ton of stuff up in my attic that has been sitting up there since I moved into my house here. And it's all like silly stuff. It's stuff that I used to have as a single person and in my college days where I would have all these like weird little gadgets just hanging around and when we moved into our house I'm just like where do I put all these toys so they've been sitting up in my attic and you know what my shelves deserve some silliness so I went up into my attic and I pulled some of it down and I'm gonna show you what I have if you are new here, I hope that you stick around, hit that subscribe button and the notification bell. That way you can see all of my new videos when they are new. I also would love if you give me a thumbs up and comment below. Do you guys have any of these ridiculous things? What kind of ridiculous things do you have at home? Do you let the little kid in you out and buy silly things for yourselves? I think I'm gonna start. So let's get right on into it. I have a bag and a box here and I'm just going to show you little things as I go. So I don't know what I'm pulling out first, but here we go. Okay, so I have this Batman Pez collection. So it has Two-Face, uh, the Riddler, Joker, and Batman. I don't remember when I got this or if it was a gift or what, but it's gonna go up on my shelves. So that is definitely the first one. It's got blue on it, so maybe I'll put it up by my blue books. So that's cool. I mean, if you know me, you know I love Batman. Then of course we have my Minions Army. So we have this little guy, and I don't know if any of their sounds work. Oh, yep, yeah, so he has the fart gun. <laughs> so that's the first one. I was obsessed with minions. I loved them for the longest time and I still do. I think they're so cute. I got the little one with the banana. I don't know if these work anymore. I don't think so. I don't think so guys. Nope. It's okay. He's still super cute. So that's the second guy. I can't remember all of their names. Here's another one with another gun. Little guy. Oh, this one's like this. <laughs> I think is there I know there's Dave and Tim. I think Tim is this guy, the little the taller guy. So I think these were all from McDonald's or something. McDonald's is good for that. So there's him. And then, oh my gosh, they all have guns. <laughs> yeah, there's the jelly gun, you know? Okay. And then, who else do I have in here? Oh my gosh, there's still more. And this guy. Oh, I wish these still worked. Oh, they don't, but he used to be like, huh? <laughs> like, what? Yeah, I love minions. I can't wait to put them back on my shelves. I think that's all for minions. Oh my gosh, there's more. No, I have, I have two. I have two of the banana guys. This one probably doesn't work either. I'll give this banana guy to someone else because I don't need two. Okay. Then of course we have more Batman stuff. So I was in college a community advisor. And if it was your college, it was probably called a resident advisor. And this, one of my very best friends, Emily, made this. They were called door decks. So you used to get these little um, door deck thingies. So door deck, like a door decoration on your door from your community advisor. And I love Batman and she did this for me with a little bowl. So there's another Batman little guy I'm gonna put that up somewhere oh I found batteries up there so I was like why are there batteries up here like we probably should be able to use those here's another Batman 
my name on it. I like that one very much. So I'm gonna find some places for these guys. Oh, I found, I have a Nintendo DS. I found Scrabble up there. So I'm happy to be able to play that. Um, Cause I do have the DS down here somewhere. I just didn't realize Scrabble was up there. So during this time of needing things to do, I should probably have pulled that down. I also found a memory stick. So that would be nice. Never opened. Don't know why it's up there. So that was cool. I brought that down. Then I used to have this thing back when, so this is like for your phone. So it's like a little holder that you put your phone in. You can kind of move these, I think a little bit, maybe not. Um, but you would put your phone in here. And at the time my phone was too small. I just had one of those dumb razor flip phones. But now I'm like, oh my gosh, this would be so good. Can I fit my phone in here? I'm so excited. Like that is super cool. And then I can just set it down and be able to, when I'm talking to people, like, hey, there you go. God, I'm so excited. Oh, look at my little thing one. I got this when I went to Florida. You know, Dr. Seuss, little thing one. Isn't he just the cutest little guy? So I'm gonna put him up on one of my shelves. Another Batman Pez. I think I had a couple of these actually. So I can always have more than one. And then some adapter thing that I was like, this has probably come in handy somewhere. So I brought that downstairs. I have a little Tigger Pez. So I thought that was pretty cool. Could put next to the orange books. Then I found all of these little guys that I think I got from McDonald's, but it's Dorothy from Wizard of Oz. So I'm gonna put her up on my shelf too. So that's Dorothy. And then I have the Scarecrow. And then I have the Wicked Witch. The Wicked Witch. Yes. So those all connect. Oh, yep. Here's another Pez for Batman. So there's a lot of Batman happening. And then a little My Little Pony. Isn't she cute? She's so cute. So yeah, seeing as I'm trying to reorganize my shelves, because I did, and you'll see some footage um, here where I um, am showing you what the shelf look, used to look like. So there's some whites and some grays, and then I kind of have some blacks. And then I was trying to do like shelves that were more like these are my TBR shelves, and then these are the my red shelves. And then I just realized that I want more of the colored shelves you know where you have all the books of the same colors so now what i'm going to be doing is um reorganizing them and i've done it already and then i'm going to be able to put these cool little things that i've had for some time up back up on my shelves and I am going to do all the books that I have read are going to be sitting up and then all of my TBR books will be stacked and that's how I'll know the difference but at least they're all within the same colors. So to keep going I used to be obsessed with Marvel like the this is like a regular like photo thing so this was ser like serious guys when I was in college this is what was up on my shelves that I had in my dorm room. This is like a photo thing that you would put like little like kids photographs in for like school or whatever. I put Marvel character playing cards in here and these were my favorite characters at the time which was Wolverine and then who is that? That's Phoenix, um, Mr. X, Rogue, and Gambit. These were my favorite ones. So I had them in this like little thing here. So I don't know if I'm gonna put that up, but it's really silly. And then I have more of the cards here. So I have all of the characters. Um, I have no idea where I got those from or why I have them, but I do. And then I have this little guy. It's like a little tiny, um, Avengers comic. It's like super, super tiny that came with one of these. So that's super cute. And then I had these things called Figure Factory. Um, I don't know if you guys have had these, but you would buy them. I think we bought them at Target. And then the, the whole thing would fit in here and you would have instructions on how to put something like the little guy together and you would collect them. There's a ton of them out there and they would be in these little like um, figure factory boxes and then you would make them and they would look like this. So this is Spider-Man. So I made this guys, like I put this together with super glue. <laughs> 
So I have a little Spider-Man here. And then I also have um, Wolverine. Doctor Doom. Yeah. And then this one I must not have finished because it's like purpley stuff. I don't know who was supposed to be on this. But it looks like I didn't quite finish him. Oh! It was Nightcrawler! Nightcrawler is going to be in here somewhere. Oh, look at little Nightcrawler. Oh, I should try to figure this out. But yeah, I've got all the pieces. Then, I'm not quite sure, but you can see I've got a little Harry Potter with his little wand. I don't know where his night bus is because this is supposed to be for the night bus. But I have a little Harry Potter and I have his trunk. So this is a Legos guy. I used to have, it's got to be up there somewhere and I'm just missing it. But his trunk has some books in it or, or, or clothes. I don't know. What does that look like? Can you see that? Yeah. So that's in his little luggage here. His little trunk. And then it has the little serious black dog. And yeah, I don't know where. And then the lamp post. So there's a lamp post that came with it and a bush that Sirius was hiding behind. But the night bus must be somewhere, somewhere upstairs. Oh yeah, here's Hedwig, little Hedwig. She's probably on the trunk like that, little Hedwig. Um, but yeah, so the night bus must be upstairs somewhere because it's not here. And I just found another little comic, little comic here. This is Spider Girl, so that's kind of, cool really tiny i don't know if i can actually read this i could probably try really hard but avengers in that and i think these are all i must have made them all but i don't know where all of them are because there's like five of them in here oh look i haven't yet made this one. Oh, that would be cool what is this one? Oh, who is this Ooh, is this another spider-man one this one might be another Spider-Man one. Yeah, it's Spider-Man coming out of a... Yeah, it's Spider-Man coming out of a... I don't know if you can see that. Oh, that's cool. I might want to make that. I didn't realize I had any in here. That's so cool. Well, let me check the other ones. Okay, so that's that one. Oh, there's one in here, too. Oh, what's in here? Oh, it's got like red. Oh, who is it? 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 Oh, it's Cyclops. Oh, it's Cyclops. Oh, that'll be fun. Maybe I should make these. That'd be so cool. Oh, I wonder if I have any more. Was well, that one I just opened? Yes, that's the one I just opened. And then... Then the other ones are all empty, so I made them already. Oh, I'm so excited. I'm such a dork. Oh my goodness. Okay, so that's that. So I found all this stuff up in the attic. And really, guys, there was a couple more really nerdy things up there. I went ahead and left it up there because I want more display things that I still think are cool. Um, no one needs to see any of that other stuff. But uh, maybe I'll bring it down at another time. Um, so kind of dorky. I'm going to go ahead and put this all on my shelves and show you what the end product is.
So I hope you enjoyed that super silly fun thing. I reorganized my shelves and thought that they needed a little bit of spice. So I went ahead and collected some things from the attic and brought it on down because I have a kid in me and I bet you have a kid in you. So maybe you should go up in your attic or wherever you're storing your old stuff and bring it on out and put it onto those shelves because they deserve some spice. I hope you enjoyed this video and uh, if you did, go ahead and give me a thumbs up. Uh, if you have not yet subscribed, go ahead and do that and turn on the notification bell. Until next time guys, I hope you're reading something great and you know how it goes. Happy reading! Bye!